how you dealing with we in the industry we know how i get all right i know you probably got a couple features on a, on a project that's about to come out with drama i feel like you ain't announced it but like i've seen the song i heard his voice and it just it just told me drama so <laughs> we could just did that right now right right drama you ain't announced it but i mean come on bro just it yeah, ain't no secret. We, a, I, I saw it and it's, I automatically it's, it's, it's knew. It's gonna come out regardless. All right, bro. bro so come on, come on. It's, God it's, damn. It's, all right, it's for sure. <laughs> all right, but <laughs> besides from that, your last project. Um, what was the name of it? Um, the real well, name of the last project. What definition of definition big dude? of big dude? Yeah, uh-huh. you had one feature on that. Fat Troll. Shout out to my guy. Yeah. And I part of me was like, man, yeah, man, because I, I, I did interview Fat Troll and I know he said he got mad love for you, and I'm like, yeah, that just shows. That how was much you. He, yeah. <laughs> and I was my, yeah. So he was okay. saying he was saying how much he got love for you or whatever. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, okay. Part of me like, yeah, he only got the one feature because that's his dog. But another part of me like, hold up. And you could correct me if I'm wrong. Part of me is like, you wanted other ones, but n- in the industry n- be playing. Not saying anybody particular. Was that the experience? Be real. Nah. No? I don't need careful features from people. I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm okay. so focused on myself. Like Trill was just with me last night. Nah. Like this is like my this my family. Like I look at him like family. Like, feel what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. he just moved her. Yeah. So I begged him to move her. Nah, that's my family. Me, this, this dude would stay like 20 minutes away from me now. Oh, that's what's up. So I like it. You feel mm-hmm. what I'm saying? So and this one of my favorite rappers too. Yeah. When I was like 16, 17, I was out, you feel what I'm saying? He let me talk to Cheek Keep last night. Jeez. So I'm like, hold on, whoa, like you feel what I'm saying? But I went out one of cheeky beats, and he was like, oh, shorty, you approved, no cap on gang. <laughs> so we up. talking like we texting that, but it's like he like I, like, I heard about you before. He was like, I see Trill call me, and then you get in the camera, I'm like, oh, big old CMG, what's up, CMG? Yeah. That's all he said. He's like, what's up, CMG? <laughs> yeah, I'm like, I don't think that know my name for real. I, I think he just said, "What's up, big old COG?" Right. I said, "Oh, he's shining, and he's shining." That's cool. I'm like, yeah, for sure. He was like, "I heard your song before." I'm like, "Yeah." I'm like, "Big dude." He was like, "That's you." I'm like, "Yeah." He was like, "We got a link, bro." He was like, I'm in LA. I was like, "Man, I'm gonna come out there in a minute." So it's all. Love. So you ain't want none. You ain't want no other. There was no features that you wanted to get, but you couldn't get. Nah, cause I ain't gonna lie. Like what I had to learn about the industry, it like. Some people genuine, some people not. Mm-hmm. You can't, you can't even come in the game fresh. Just you can't come in the game fresh with feelings, and that's what I did. And that's why I want to go because I'm a genuine person. It's the conversation I want to yeah, get. Into, and yeah, and I'm a genuine person. So like certain shit other rappers did, and I loved it, and I like I feel a type of way about them. It hurt my feelings, and I and, 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 like I went to my manager about this, like and a lot of people. You feel what I'm saying? Like, not a lot of people because I ain't a people person, but I'm, I'm I'm a people person, but I'm not friendly. I get it. So when I went to my, my my team and I'm letting them know about it, they were like, they were like, no, sometimes you just sometimes they some people not like you. Some people just you give with the talent. They ain't they ain't genuine. They just gifted. You feel what I'm saying? Like the devil almost also got blessings too. He not he can That's bless you fact. too. Come on, man. So you know Don't start that shit on here. Yeah, I'm with you, because we can hey, just talk about that. I can talk about shit. <laughs> hey, dog. hey I'm, I'm with I'm, that 100 percent People be yeah. overlooking them devil blessings. You be talking about them blessed. Yeah, you think yeah, it ain't from he, God. Cause you gotta look at it. He can be blessed so fast and yeah, the devil blessed him with that. He mm-hmm. got to do all, he was everything to just keep that. Yep. You feel what I'm saying? Yep. That's why other, that's why genuine people around the world, genuine people run the world. So when they see it, they're not going to rock with you no more. Yeah. Now your name gone down the drain. Mm-hmm. Now you got negative shit coming towards your way. All because what? You're not genuine. You just like you just got the diamonds. And what you don't understand is one thing about the devil, bro. Like, we think that we could just pinpoint the devil because it's... it's, it's it looks different. Now nah, what happened nah. with the devil, he make it look the same, he make it feel comfortable, he make it feel good. So when you deal when you dealing in these activities, it feel good. It's like, yeah, man, whole time you worshiping the devil. But that's a conversation for another time, bro. But that's because yeah. that, that's why I said we get that's my vibe right there. Yeah. But not so it's so your team, so you ain't reach out for, to get the the features because your team already let you know how, how it was, how the game was. No, no, no. I'm saying or did you like, had to learn that on your own. I had to learn it on my own. You feel what I'm saying? Like I'm thinking certain rappers f with me how I f with them whole time is not this. How did you learn it without saying a name, a specific name or anything? It was certain situations just came up and, and I'm like, damn. Like what? What situation? Like not don't pinpoint a particular time. I mean just I'm just curious. You know what ain't think? genuine. Mm. You know what ain't genuine. You feel what I'm saying? So if you know, deal I... with a, you deal with a person in a situation, it doesn't matter what it is. You deal with any person, and the love ain't received. You, you yep. know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't receiving it. How you give it, yeah, mm. don't be blind to it. Mm. 
every good feeling, you go with it. That's a fact. So you learned that before you was about to drop the tape? Yeah, no, nah, I learned it while working. Before I even thought about the tape. I would, you feel what I'm saying? But, okay. I mean, I don't, I don't hate nobody. You feel I just, I just fall back. Like, S- I'm I'm trying to paint the picture because I like I, I get it 100. Yeah, that's why I, like I feel it. That's why I want to talk to you about it because I'm I'm in my mind I'm wondering. Okay, you in the industry, you doing your thing, love ain't reciprocated, so you learn that ain't genuine. Then you drop the tape. So because you already learned that ain't genuine, I don't want no features. Or was it a thing where you working on the tape, you trying to fuck when ain't reciprocating it? So it's like fuck everybody. That's what I was wondering. No, no, it's like. The first one you said. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. That, yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, like yeah. it ain't, it ain't about them. Like it is like it's me. Like it's my fault. Like I gotta, I gotta hit myself on the chin for that. You mm-hmm. feel what I'm saying? Because I came in the game with feelings, mm-hmm. and, and you feel what I'm saying? Like I don't give a fuck if you if I feel like you fuck with me, I'm finna give you my all of a, of a friend. Come bun. on, man. You feel what I'm saying? Like I'm finna give you my all of a friend bun. But if it ain't that, I see it for myself. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. how hard was that to? To, to realize or come to realization to understand and be okay with? Or was that something easy to be okay with? It I mean, I was hard-headed at first. I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I wouldn't listen to nothing. Mm-hmm. I wouldn't listen to shit And I was just going with it. But like how my people is, how my OGs is, they let me bump my head. Mm-hmm. So then when I bumped it, I bumped that motherfucker no more. <laughs> that hurt. What was the biggest lesson you learned through all of it, you think? Uh, patience. Patience. Being patient. What about it though? Um, I, I, if, at first I feel like, like, cause I know my heart good, and I know I ain't sour, and I know I'm a hard work, and I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a good soul. Mm-hmm. I know I am, but it's like, the harder I was going, I feel like I wasn't getting flowers, as I should. You mm-hmm. feel what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. it was like, I was really rushing it. I was like, you know what? Like I was trying to demand it, other than trying to. Just let it come, type. Shit, you feel me? So it's like when I once some one day I just sat back and be like, you know what? F- it, bro. What was that realization moment? Like what? What? What was that? Like what made me say yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what made me say that? Oh, uh, I just you you know you know like I feel like I want me. Mm-hmm. Like I feel like I'm just a a normal guy. I feel like I ain't big boogie. I feel like you feel what I'm saying? Like damn, everybody else turning up. What about me? And I know I work hard as them. Right. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, but I'm like, I'm a I'm a team player, so I don't never be on no shit like, oh, okay, I'll hate on this. I can't even hate on no niggas, man. Like, that ain't got nothing to do with me. I'm real big on that. That ain't my business. Yeah, facts. But it's like certain like certain shit go on on this end, it ain't going on on my end. And I'm like, what the fuck I'm missing? Mm. You feel what I'm saying? And I used to be like that. I used to be like, what the, what I'm missing? But the whole time, I just had to wait. Wait my turn and do what I did. It's crazy and, and it's here, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this this is about you, but um, <laughs> this interview is about you. But I, I want to share something similar. My my shit, my um my coming to realization moment was kind of opposite, and it was just recently. That's why I asked you. Like I just went out of town, Philly, New York, and I did like a press run on my own, and like all my peers was like showing me love. You feel me? And at that moment, because I'm the same way, I'm like, bro, I gotta, I'm turning like. Ain't respecting me how they should. Yeah. But when I was doing an interview with my peers, giving my roses, showing my, my respect, and I understood at that moment it was like, you know what? Where it matter, it does matter. Like the people that need to salute me are saluting me, so I can be easy on myself. Not saying stop working hard, but I can relax a little bit. You gonna know say yeah, like, bro, you, you don't be, have to stress you, it too much. Because at the point you be so hard on yourself, you be like, man, you trying to overwork yourself just to prove a point to them yep. all the time. Them. No, like it's that. really about you. This your life. Mm-hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Either they like it or not. They mm-hmm. gotta respect it. No, facts. You feel what I'm saying? So all respect get flowers. Oh, you know. 